What's up, YouTube? I'm your boy, Double A Nine Skills. This is the Road to Foot Champions RTG Edition, and welcome back, Booyah Nation, to the Reward Edition, baby. We got Elite One Rewards. Welcome back to the Massive Pimple Edition, bros. I got this humongous pimple right here. It hurts. I don't usually get pimples a lot. It's not. I don't get it often, but for some reason, I got this one here, and it is humongous, bros. It's like it's almost as big as my entire face. And let's be honest, I got a massive face. I got one on my nose too. Like, yo, come on, man. What's up with this breakout season? Let me know in the comments down below if you just absolutely hate, like, anytime you got something important to do, you just break out again. Maybe it's just, I don't know, maybe it's just nerves or something. I don't know. Anyways, bros, we have six packs that we are saving for Team of the year we also have our elite one rewards that we're about to pop open right now as you can see as i go through here i have been selling pretty much selling my club man um and i did it all to get mateus i've been selling gold cards bronze cards i've pretty much been listing everything during the week a lot of uh call it, uh, what was it a uh, city i players and um MLS players were selling like crazy. I have not done the new marquee matchup. Matter of fact, I haven't even looked at the new marquee matchup. Um, so that's something that I might do in this episode today. The mark, uh, Bayer Leverkusen and, 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 and Bayern. Um, I'm not sure if I have a lot of these players. Liverpool City, I might be able to do. I'm not sure, man. Hopefully, I got some of these here. But anyways, let's pop open our rewards, bros. Now, as you know, Gareth Bale is really the only card. I guess Immobile will make us a little bit of money. Maybe Koulibaly will make us a little bit of money. But the only time we'll make any money, I think we have to hit Koulibaly, which is an 86 rated. We have to hit these guys from the Liga Nos don't matter. Dawson and Brahimi don't really matter. Um, Gareth Bale and Mobley. I feel like those guys can make us a bit of money. Maybe Roberto. I'm not sure what he's going for, but the chances are very slim. Now, most people would hold their rewards, but I'm not, I, I don't do that. I did it one time. I don't really do it often because this series is about this. It's about playing your weekend league, opening your rewards right away, and seeing what we get, man. Seeing what we get for playing the weekend league. The two jumbo packs will wait for team of the year. I obviously just got my two jumbo packs that I've won. I messed up with and took an epic L. And then one that I opened on purpose. And well, as you know, it didn't really pan out well. So, we now have eight packs, which are 400k packs. Oh, I went to the wrong place. 400k packs. And then a bunch of like ones that we got for pre-ordering the game, which are these over here. Um, so, uh, yeah, that's what we got. And then now we have these two team of the weeks to open up. So remember, Gareth Bale, Koulibaly, or Immobile. Chances of any of those popping very slim. But we're going to get into it, man. If you love this Road to Glory series, please smash. Oh, not even love it. If you just like this love Road to Glory, smash a big old thumbs up for your boy. Can we get 15,000 likes? Drop that positivity. Maybe we can get back into the top 100. Um, that would be pretty sick. But I'm pretty happy with this. We went from 39 and 1 to 35 and 5. We could have been 36 and, one, uh, and, and 4. But. Top 100 to Elite 1. I'm happy with that. That's what we were doing last year. Elite 1, Top 100. Elite 1, Top 100. That's what we were doing last year. That's what I want to be doing this year. So, hopefully, uh, you know, the, the trend starts now. Let's do this, though, man. Uh, three Team of the Weeks guaranteed. Let's see what's in it. A Gareth Bale would obviously pop it off. We got Pugba last week, so I know EA's not, you know, going to bless this account two times in a row. Let's just be honest with each other. We're going to get a trash one. A very, very trash one. Crystal Palace, CDM. 81 overall. Whoo, man. All right. All right, EA. I see which. Oh, we also have to buy Alexandro in this episode. The first one, Christian Tello. That's a very interesting one. He's a 3 3, though. Medium low. He would be an outstanding cam. 92 pace. Ah, yo, it's just, it's, it's a little bit, it's a little bit eh. It's a little bit eh. You know, it's a little bit eh. Um, but it is what it is. Let's go ahead and put 20 on him. We're going to open up one more, man. See what we get. I don't expect nothing out of these Team of the Week, bro. I mean, out of this Elite One. I just don't expect nothing out of this finish. The Team of the Week. that The Team of the Week is being bad is not even EA's fault. Football just hasn't been... Uh, wasn't good this weekend, um, realistically. So, we can't really blame EA on that, L. That's, that's, that's a world football issue. Who's this center back? Oh, my gosh. I wonder what he goes for. Absolutely nothing, right? Goodness gracious. All right, let's list him up for 20, and uh, let's get it, man. Let's jump directly in um, to the last one, bros, and then we'll buy Alexandro and then play some games. I almost opened up the wrong one. Dude, I almost opened, a, I almost opened my 100K pack. All right, here we go. Last one, man. Here we go, boys. We got an 81 as our big, as our big card. Our face card was an 81 last time. What's it going to be this time? Let's find out. Let's see. What's it going to be? Spanish. Right back. Ah, Roberto. I mean, I'm not mad at it because it is an 84. Like, it could have been worse. I don't know what Roberto sells for, so I'm not going to crazy. Maybe we'll make like 30, 40, 50K on him. If we make 50K, I'm already I'm already happy. Damn, Andy Carroll, stop that. Uh, EA, stop that. Um, if we make, what are we making? 30K? 20K? 30K? He's around 20, 30. Ah, Alexandro. 
went up loads, man. I actually sold him for a lot less than I bought him for. So this here is the part of the video where things get interesting, they get fun, they get juicy, they get nice, they get fun, they get woo, it's gonna get good. I have my, my, my freaking finger on the A button, bros. I literally on the A button, that's the X button if you're on the beautiful PlayStation. And I had, you, that's the A, that's what that B button if you're on the Switch, you know, FIFA's on, anyways. So it's terrible on the Switch, by the way. I had, it was the worst. Anyways, bros, listen, man. I had the, my freaking finger on the A button. It's like, it's like, like when you're a kid or something, your mom's like, yo, don't touch that button. You're like, mm, I'm gonna touch that button. And I was this close, you know what I'm saying, to listing Mateus. I call my brother, bring, bring, yo, I'm on the phone with him. I jump in my Discord, my homie in there, Joe from Denmark, DJ, uh, the boy Kid Mamito, my boy Tron, these guys, besides Kid Mamito, these guys been watching me for like six, seven years, these guys been, nah, nah, maybe not, maybe like four or five years, they, they've been watching me since like the Justin TV days and stuff, man, Twitch TV, but before, before Justin was Twitch, it was just, anyways, so, they're in there and they're like, yo, you sure you're about to list this Mateus? The Booyah Nation got about to go, about to go mental on you, and I was like, hold on, chill, let me explain. So I was really thinking about picking up Prime Thierry Henry. Now before we go on and talk about Thierry Henry and listing Prime uh, uh, Mateus, what you're watching right now, you're going to watch the first, um, you are going to watch the first, uh, the, well, I'm about to win Division 1. I, I literally, I just finished winning Division 1, now I'm commentating it. So I'm going to show the first half of the last, the two last games, the first half of the both last games to win Division 1. You can see how the team's playing, you can see two different opponents, two different teams, and you can see how we're scoring, who's scoring, and how we won Division 1 to pick up 15,000 coins. So I have 160,000 coins on my account, right? And... Well, before I say that, this team has Mateus Bakioko Vieira in the midfield. Anthony Martial is now my cam. Zaha got dropped. Thierry Henry and Bappe the strikers. That's what I ran for the last two games of this Division One run. And I felt that men, men, like Anthony Martial is like, like I've never watched Walking Dead, but I know Walking Dead's about zombies. And it's like Walking, like you kill the zombie, but it keeps coming back. You understand? You kill him, it keeps coming back. You kill him, it keeps coming back. It's like a, a bad relationship that you break up with the girl, but then you get back in the relationship and then you break up with the girl. It happens, right? You just keep getting back with her because you really like her, but you know you're not good for each other, but you keep, it's kind of like me and Anthony Machiao. Like, I'm like, look, dude, I'm done with you. And I get, I put him away. I even get him off my reserve. I get him off my team and then I, I get him back and I get rid of him and I get him back and I get rid, and I can't seem to get, and this is not like a relationship like me and De Gea. Like De Gea and I, we, we went back for, you know, we had like, we went back and forth a few times and I got to the point I was like, like, I found Farm and he's so much better than you. You know, I feel like this is a Taylor Swift song. I feel like if I was Taylor Swift, I could grab my guitar right now and make a song about this, right? So, and then I get Anthony Martial and, I, and I'm like, you know what, Anthony, I'm done with you. I want full cam on everybody. So I'm putting Zaha in and I'm going with Mateus Bakioko Vieira, Zaha, Anthony Martial, and Bappe, everybody, I mean, Thierry Henry and Bappe, Zaha. Now everybody's on 10 cam. Yes! And I play a few games and I start noticing how people are dominating me in the midfield. And I'm like, why is this happening? I have Bakioko, Vieira, and Mateo. Why am I getting dominated? And and then I, I put Anthony Martial in, and all the domination goes away because Anthony Martial, for some reason, switches nicely with the right CM. So my Mateo switches with Anthony. Like, they switch around nicely. So... You, 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 when, when I had Petit, Petit would switch with Zaha, and I just, I didn't like it because Petit has 77 pace, and I'm a pace war, man. I'm just, I'm realistic. But when Anthony Martial drops back, Mateus takes that spot. Mateus got 87 pace. He's fast, he's almost faster than Anthony Martial. Well, he is faster than Anthony Martial because with the chem style on 10 chem and Anthony Martial on 7, he's probably faster if chem styles work. Now, um... With all that being said, I don't know, I don't know if Kim Styles, I just put them on. I don't know what they do, bros. I just I just rock out with them. Um, but yeah, as I was saying, man, Thierry Henry. So I put my stats on Twitter of my my second, because I have the second Thierry Henry. Not the baby, we got the middle one. We got middle Thierry Henry. You know what I'm saying? It's, you know, I don't got the one where he has no chest, no hair chest, like no chest on his hair yet. I got the one where he has a little bit of chest there. He's starting to grow a little beard, but it's not quite there yet. You know, he's he's like He's almost, but if you got the prime one, you know, you got the chest hair, you got, like, he's a grown man. We don't got that one yet. We got the middle one, right? But the middle one sometimes is nice, man, because a lot of times, you know, your life peaks right in the middle. You know what I'm saying? And then when you get older, it's just not a peak no more. You know what I'm saying? So maybe I got the right one, but I put his stats and everybody on Twitter is going mad. They're like, skills, this is sick. Yo, how do you have 160 games played with 259 goals and 130 assists to my, like, to, and I'm like, I don't know. He's good. But then I start sitting there, I'm like, man, what could this prime, could this prime Thierry Henry be better? Like, what's better? Like, is 169 games played 400 goals? What that one's gonna, what's that one gonna do? And I really was like, look, if I put Thierry Henry there, 
Anthony Martial now gets full cam. Zaha gets put back into the team, but Anthony Martial's back in the midfield. How do I feel about it? I would have to sell Thierry on re plus Mateus. I did the math. I called him. My brother's like my accountant, right? When it comes to FIFA, this guy's my accountant, man. I call him up like, yo, bro, you know how to do the math of like 5% off of this and this and that. You know how, he's like, yeah, what are they selling for? So I told him what Thierry Henry was selling. I told him what Mateus was selling. I told him I had 150,000 coins in my account right now. Now I got like 170 because we just won Division One. And I'm like, yo, bro, how close am I? And he's like, yeah, you're 100K short. And I'm like, damn, I'm 100K short. I don't think I can come up with 100K. I mean, I could open a 100K pack. But I sit here and I go, well, if I, I could open my 100K packs right now. Forget Team of the I don't even care about Team of the, team of the Year. I could open my 100K packs and get prime Thierry Henry. And I'm like, man, I could really make this happen. But I just don't know, bros. Do I buy Thierry Henry? Yes or no? And I'm actually afraid to look at the comments. I'm afraid to look at the comments. Not because y'all are going to bash me. Because y'all are as crazy as me, bro. Y'all are going to be like, prime Thierry Henry. Hell yeah, skills. Sell it all. Get and I know y'all are going to be like me. Now, some people are going to be like, skills. Listen. Listen here, buddy. You got 39-1. Don't change it. Don't change it. It's funny, right? Because the comments are kind of like, like your friends, right? They kind of kind of like, you know, you always got that friend that's always like, yo, let's do it. Let's hit this party. Who cares what your mama said? It's all goody. You know what I'm saying? We only live once. Blah, blah, blah. And then you got the other friend that's like, now listen, okay? Stop and listen. Think about it, okay? Last time you didn't hit that party. Remember, you went home. Your mom gave you like 100 bucks more so you could waste on FIFA packs. Remember, we hung out. We ordered pizza. You know what I'm saying? That girl even texted you. You think that party's not even worth it. And the other guy's like, nah, listen, bro. You want to sit in your... That's what I feel like the comments are the ones like oh, yo get that theory over here and the other one's like scales listen you got top 100 the other way so i don't know but i know most of y'all are going to be pretty psyched about this theory on read news i just don't know if we should make it happen simply because i don't know how i don't know who's better than mateus this guy's scoring goals like it's no one's business and then i don't know if a striker prime theory on is how much i know he's better than the left wing one but how much better is he Let's really sit down and think about this, bro. Because, like, can you get better than that? When, 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 you, when you've played 169 games or something like that, I forget the stats. I have it somewhere. I think it's on my desktop. Let, let, me, let me pull the stats up so I hit y'all with some, some real news and not fake news. Where's it at? I got it somewhere on here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. All right, so he has 162 games played and 252 goals and 122 assists. My dudes, he literally has, so that's drag the one, three, five, six, seven. Um, so he has 374 contributions in 162 games. How much better can you get out of a card that goes up by three ratings? I truly don't know, right? Because it's the same thing when I look at Cristiano Ronaldo. His striker card, well, his informs come out, right? And his inform uh, goes up by one pace, one shooting, one passing, one dribbling. And I go... How much better can I actually play with this card? Now, Thierry Henry's striker prime card is much better than his left wing card, and it's a position change. But how much better can... 162 to 255. That's pretty much 100 goals more. Like, what? You know what I'm saying? So I just don't know... And you know what? After these games, he's going to be even close to that 100, that 100 stat, man. Like, he, he, he just scores goals, bros. Like, it's nobody's business. And what turns me on more to him, pause no homo with that, is the fact that the way the man gets assists. Like, when I had Ronaldo, look at that. That's going to be his assist right there. Right there. That's his assist. Like, when I had Ronaldo, yeah, he scored a lot. But I got to be honest, man. He did not he did not get assists the way this Thierry Henry gets assists. This Thierry Henry, I think it's because he's a medium. Medium, I got him stay on, stay attack, stay forward, get press, by, press back line, get in behind. With plus a medium, medium, I think he scores a lot. But at the same time, he's a medium, medium. So he's always there to give the assist to Mbappe or to Anthony Martial or Zaha, whoever's playing Cam. And it just seems to work, man. This Thierry Henry is nasty. But in the comments down below, I got to say, man, do y'all think he can be better? Because I think this, the Prime one can be better. And if it can be better, we need him. We need him. More than Prime Vieira, more than... We need him, bros. We need this guy in our life. And I know when we get him, yeah, we're back to Zaha. Yeah, we're back to, you know, regular gold Anthony Martial. Yeah, we're still rocking out with gold Bakayoko. But, yo, the more I try to replace gold Bakayoko, the more I try to replace Anthony Martial, the more I'm smacked in the face by EA that just says to me, listen, these, these guys are broken. These guys are overpowered. You remember last year, bros? I, I tried so hard to get rid of Smalling. 
I, I just didn't want Smaldini in my team no more. I was like, you know what? I'm, I'm cool, man. Like, I'm, I'm ready to get rid of Smaldini. And then Smaldini was like this zit on my face, right? As much as I want this thing to be gone, it ain't going nowhere. Not until it wants to go. Not until it's time for it to go. It ain't going. It's chilling. I could put whatever I want on it. It ain't going. It's staying. It's chilling. It's, 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 it's copacetic where it's at. It's cool. And until it wants to go away, it stay. And it's like Smaldini. Until he wanted to leave my team, he didn't leave. He stayed the entire damn year, bro. As much as I was like, you know what, Smola, next year, I mean, next next week I'm getting Sergio Ramos. He was right back in. Next week I'm getting, he's right back in. It didn't matter what I did. Smaldini was right there getting top 100 for me every single week last year. And this year, the more I want to get rid of Anthony Martial, he's like, hey, bro, listen, you ain't getting rid of me. Matter of fact, did we have him when I got top 100? The first time, oh, I want to pull it up. I'm thinking, I'm thinking hard. I had Griezmann at striker, Alessandrini at right wing. Ew, I want to pull, yo, should I pull it up? I want to pull it up. I really want to know if I had Anthony Martial. I might pull it up as I keep talking to y'all real quick. I'm going to multitask on y'all real fast as y'all watching this D1 gameplay. But, bros, I really want to pull it up because um, I actually am pretty interested to know if Anthony Martial was there for the first time we got top 100. But I don't want to keep y'all waiting. Um... I honestly don't remember when was it was it like a week it was like a month ago two months ago I forgot when was the last so the last top 100 we had Thierry Henry Zaha Anthony Martial and Mbappe and then the first time we got it bros I'm pretty sure we had Griezmann we had Anthony Martial and we had Mbappe now I could be a million times wrong on that but I'm pretty sure um this might be it this is it this is it this is it this is it I got it I got it bros I got it. Do I show the team please skills? Please tell me. Yes, I got it. Anthony Martial, Griezmann, Alessandrini, Vidal, Conte, Bakioko was my midfield. David Alaba, Boateng, um, the boy Daiba, uh, Dembele. Um, not, did I say? Who did I say? I mean, Eric Bai, not Dembele. Eric Bai, Walker, and De Gea. That was my team that got us top 100. Mbappe was on the bench. Bro, Anthony Martial has been with me every time I got top 100 this year. This guy, when I get rid of him, I don't get top 100. So Anthony Martial has to stay around. He's that good. Even if he's on 7 cam, he just has to stay around. He ain't going nowhere. He's the small Dini of me this year, I guess. I just have to have him. And then there's Bakioko, man, who I tried, man. I've tried. I bought Petit. I bought this guy. I bought that guy. This time when I bought Mateus, I said, I'm not buying Mateus to replace Bakioko because there is no replacement to Bakioko. Maybe there is when I get the, you know, prime hullet or the 90 hullet. Maybe when I get that good, like the, those cards that good, then we can re replace Bakioko. But right now, there is no replacement to Bakioko for me. So I bought Mateus knowing that he would go into the midfield somewhere and Bakioko wasn't going anywhere. And that's exactly what I've done. Look at Mateus here getting through. Oh man, what a shot. So I picked this Mateus up. How's that not a pen? I picked this Mateus up to go to the right CM. And then I was going to play Zaha at cam and have everybody on full cam. But Mbappe, I mean, Anthony Martial is going there on seven. He has to. So that's the cool thing, right? That if one day we could get Thierry Henry. Um, I feel like I got something in my mouth. Um, if I could get Thierry Henry, homies, Thierry Henry would go to striker, Anthony Martial left wing, Mbappe right wing, and then Mateus, Bakioko, and Vieira. That would be the dream right now. Obviously, if I had a pay-to-win account, I'd be rocking up with that. Well, I'd probably be rocking up with something a little bit. Look at Mateus! You see what I'm saying, bros? Dude, it's nuts. Um, I'd probably be rocking up with something better, but that's where we're at. Bros, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Good luck in the weekend league this weekend. I hope you guys do amazing. Those are my rewards. That's my thought. Let me know in the comments down below. Do I buy Thierry Henry or not? Because I'm really thinking hard about buying his prime, selling Mateus, selling his Thierry Henry, and buying him. Let me know in the comments. Smash big thumbs up. I'm going to see you tomorrow with some gameplay of the weekend league. So I have uh, been considering changing the name of this series to Road to El Arenos. Road to L's, road to oh my god, so many L's. You know we gotta put oh my god, I put oh my god in every title. We gotta put that in there. Oh my god, El Arenos to glory, I don't know. All I know is, bros, I've been taking L's every single episode for the past three episodes. Um, So I might as well take another one real quick. And it's gonna start off by me opening up a pack, trying to make 100,000 coins so I could purchase a player that I thought that you guys would think that that was a really smart idea. Now, on the road to glory, welcome back to the Road for Champions RTG edition. If you love this series, please smash a big old thumbs up. Your boy wants to pick up Prime V. Era. That's what won the vote. That's what won the straw poll. That's what you guys wanted. But at the same time, you guys also wanted me to try Mateus. Well, you wanted me to buy Mateus. If I didn't do SBC Vieira, you wanted me to buy Mateus. So I'm 100,000 coins away from Mateus after we sell Petit and all that craziness. So I sell Petit. He was cool, but, you know, I didn't really. Uh, Bakioko, yeah, he does the same thing. So I was like, okay, we went 39-1 with Bakioko.